Hello and welcome to my channel Hardware AI. This video is mainly going to be about installing ROS Melodic on your Raspberry Pi 4. But first, I would like to make a little update about this channel. Despite recently, I made quite a few videos with the reviews and comparisons of various hardware, I decided to refocus my channel on tutorials and interesting projects related to machine learning and ROS. I will still make an occasional review or comparison video about hardware, but I think where my channel can really bring value to you is knowledge and know-hows of machine learning applied to robotics, with a little bit humor here and there. Okay, update completed. Let's start with a quick recap. Most of you watching this video already know what Raspberry Pi is. It's a single board computer, low cost and very popular among makers. Not so long time ago, Raspberry Pi 4 was released. And frankly speaking, Raspberry Pi Foundation got many people, including me, by surprise with the sudden release. The main specs of new Raspberry Pi 4 are 1.5 GHz 64-bit quad-core ARM Cortex-A 72 processor, the choice of 1, 2 or 4 GB of RAM, USB 3.0 ports, two of them, and 500 MHz video core 6 integrated GPU. Some other notable features include Bluetooth 5, full gigabit Ethernet, and dual monitor support. It runs latest version of Linux Debian operating system, which as of moment of Raspberry Pi 4 launch wasn't even officially released. Oh, and one more point. New Raspberry Pi 4 is much hotter. I love this line from Tom's hardware review of Raspberry Pi 4. I'll quote it here. But kids especially should be sure to pick up the Pi by its size only. So that line says all about thermal properties of Raspberry Pi 4. ROS stands for Robotic Operating System. And despite the name suggests it's an OS, it's in fact just a collection of software frameworks for robots development. It makes building robots easier and less labor-intensive because there are so many packages available. You don't need to build many things from scratch. There are packages for navigation, inverse kinematics, motor control, SLAM, you name it. There is a caveat though, it has very steep learning curve. I started with ROS in year 2016 and I still cannot say I mastered it. Since Raspberry Pi 4 is brand new, there are no pre-built binaries you can just download with aptitude get command and go on with your robot building activities. You need to compile ROS Melodic from source on Raspberry Pi 4. Here is a short recap of me compiling ROS Melodic on Raspberry Pi 4 from source. In order for you to get through compilation process faster, I wrote an article on Instructables and made this video. For the full tutorial, have a look at the article, link in the description, and just a few key points here. ROSCOM is preferred unless you really, really need graphical user interface. You need to increase the swap size at least to 2 GB. RVs requires Ogre 1.9 because in differences how Libboost library handles the time in the old and new versions, some manual changes needed to be made in ROS source files. After compilation was over, I configured ROS 
to run on multiple machines because my Raspberry Pi is running a headless system and tried a few demos such as laser scan with low-cost RP LiDAR and depth estimation with Kinect. All processing was done on the Raspberry Pi 4 locally and desktop computer was just used for running RVs for displaying the information. A quick note on headless system while I'm discussing that. Getting used to using bash terminal and controlling the system uh, with SSH is a bit like losing your virginity. It feels clumsy and awkward the first time you do it and the second time and quite possibly the third time, but then you you start getting the hang of it and enjoying all the extra resources your system has and that extra space on your desk that's not occupied by another screen. And then you just don't want to go back to using graphical user interface and you want to tell all your friends about how awesome it is using system headless. So yeah, I can definitely see the parallels between those two. I hope my article and my video helped you to install ROS on your Raspberry Pi 4 and build some awesome robots with it. If so, press the like button. And if you want to see more videos about machine learning and robotics, subscribe to my channel. Until the next time.